personalities, yeah. And, and the way they play, they kind of weirdly similar styles, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's and it across a lot of different palettes as well, so it's kind of interesting to see how that all, lay, all lay, lays over. Even between Cola and Goblin, honestly. Oh, there you go, it's Rishon. You were hey. talking about it before, actually, so yeah. cool. Good to see Menonet against Roy. This can be scary for Roy. I mean, off stage, we talked about how good back air can be. Base knockback, like what? Off stage for Roy is always scary if a character can chase him out there. Meta Knight certainly can do that. Yeah, real Sean, I'm for, I'm racking my brain as to what his claim to fame is. And it's an older Smash 4 tournament I know. It's been the life of me. I can't remember what it was. But looking very comfortable in his matchup right now. Nice. And I think. He didn't have a Not jump. Quite. Yeah, he didn't have a jump, so Real Sean got aggressive, but Goblin answered back with counter aggression, which is so good to do. Up B right at him. Roy's up B, good hitbox on it, so doesn't doesn't give him a lot of juice in terms of recovery, but it is nice to swap people away. He's gonna have to recover again here. Good positioning. Goblin going low though. Very nice recovery, man. Goblin stealing that first stock. He was off stage in bad position twice and he made it work out for us. A very clean play from the Roy. And sometimes all it takes is the simplest thing. Jab back air, your bread and butter. No or chair. just jab forward smash. Oh my god, he's Jor dead. Jorward smash, very nice. I hate you so much. I know, but Goblin likes it, so you know, <laughs> it is what it is. Watch his bottom and be like, yep. Oh, That's the right. counter? That was the, that was the Jorward smash. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, man. Pressure here. Real Ooh, Sean taking there's the first that new back air. Oh my god, dude. And I mean, that, it was already got, ridiculous. Let's that be real got for a deleted. second. deleted. It's so funny, like, uh, again, of all moves on Meta Knight's above, that's crazy. Oh my god, did you Ooh. see that conversion? Yeah, the high jump on the back here, too. Mm -hmm. Super clean from Goblin. The pressure's immaculate right now. Can't get out of the corner against this man, unless you roll behind him, apparently. Down tilt. All right, fair enough. Come on, Goblin, I'm trying to hype you up, man. That's what I'm saying. Back here, yep. waiting it out. Yep. Great tech chase right there from uh, Real Sean. We're going on a ride. Dis disadvantage very well. Yeah, man. It's not even Marvel time yet. Taking for a ride up there. Very nice. Oof. Rising, getting the hilt hit. Very powerful. And shot by Goblin, man. It's crazy that how quickly that... <laughs> dude, is, I, he's just gone. I love... Dude, it's happened so many times where we come back to the camera and they're both just gone. <laughs> they're like, yep, best of one. <laughs> Shake my hand. That was a chat. Shake my hand. Chat right now. Yep, 1-0, 1-0, GG's. And it's crazy, too, because, like, <laughs> that match was so quick with that jab forward smash yeah. there laid in the middle, where it didn't even feel like that was the last stock. It was just over before it could happen. Yeah. Well, dude, and the other thing is, you got to give Goblin so much credit for the way he recovered, too, because, yeah. again, if if Sean got off to a lead there... A lesser how... player. A lesser player would have died. Yeah, easily, easily. And as a Roy, it's, it's very similar to seeing other characters who are high octane. You see it with Light as well. We talked about Moist uh, Esports. With Light, you see the same thing, where if you're off state, Light's recoveries with Fox, everyone talks about his offense and his movement, which are all incredible, but his recoveries are in insane, too. Same thing with Goblin, man. You gotta make it work with these characters. You're kind of glass cannon -y like that. There's been a couple sequences already where Real Sean was fairly close and just cannot quite push Roy far enough away. And it's not the easiest thing to do, either. I mean, Meta Knight has the move sets to go out there, but you have to be constantly reacting to where all these multi-hitboxes are sending you. Right. Right, pressure here. Let's see what Real Sean could do. Goblin at the ledge here, too. Back air drags him down. He is mm. so good at those tech situations uh, with the drag downs. Very nice stuff there. Real Sean. His pressure is, is also very, very strong. Ooh. Charging the F-Smash there, but Goblin is actually going to come through with the double edge blade. Yeah. Yeah, what he did there, too, is he, the timing was really, really nice from Goblin on those hits, so. Here we go, though. Rising down air. And that's going to be one of the things that, like, Real Sean's going to have to look for. Wow. Bone yeah. 64. Okay, that makes a little more sense. I was just looking at and Goblin's numbers because it, it just felt like from what we've seen, that Real Sean was kind of in the lead for that stock, but despite that, was still down 60% the entire time. Tech again, he's so good. Again, jumping right there is so smart because you can fastball and then dash um, to try to catch the roll away or roll in or anything like that. But if you jump, you can also react to neutral get up mm -hmm. and, and get up attack. And Meta Knight Meta has such quick aerials that are so low to the ground to begin with that it's super easy for him to just jump over the get up attack like we've seen a couple times now. Mm -hmm. Go, man. Here's the thing though, Goblin holding out to the stocks, oh, Roy with Rage is just insane, oh, especially at the ledge, Broza, it's just wild shit. Oh god, oh god! Uh oh. Might be the Goblin show. Finishing off that forward tilt, pressure off stage. Oh, he jumped, I don't know if he jumped off him or not, but either way, he couldn't make it back. A little taunt, maybe Real Sean's coming to life here, Broza. However, he's got a two stock uh, deficit to make up. See that throw there, continues the up tilt, or the up air strings now. 
Falling up air into another up air. Very nice. Very reminiscent of how he closed out game one, actually. This is the first pair he doesn't get the second one. And this is just looking like Goblin's got this on lock at this point. 111 on the uh -oh. last knock. See ya. Yep. See ya. Yep. Yeah, yep. that's easy. Yep. Missing Ooh. the shuttle loop to the ledge. Goblin capitalizing, of course, forward smash. The king! My man just completely unfazed by this. Just business as usual for Goblin. He's Which like, is crazy. Yeah. Sean's a good player. Yeah, and, and, and Goblin's one of those players, too, where you've really seen him develop over the course of Ultimate's lifespan. Like, in Smash 4, yeah. he was a player that would, like could cause upsets and would occasionally like make his way into his top 16s or his top 32s, and you're just like, oh, man, this, here's that Roy player. That's really cool. 